NorthJerseySports.com Athlete of the Week. You can nominate an athlete by tweeting at us, hashtag NJSAOTW, or emailing us at NJSAOTW at gmail.com. NJSIA State Football Finals at MetLife Stadium, Group 3 North 1 Final. Riverdale looking to finally break through after being so close the last few seasons, while Old Japan is looking to repeat. Let's go inside the locker room with Coach Dunn using this Campus Confidential All Access Pass granted by Small Moments Productions. 12 months ago, exactly 12 months ago, we walked off this field on a great day, great day for our, our squad, our, our football team, and uh, most of you guys are part of that. We walked off that field, there was a lot of hard work, a lot of heart, a lot of determination, great effort that went into it. And I remember walking off and people saying, wow, that was all the fans year. That was just their year. Right? They had the guys, they had the, the, the players, it was their year. 364 days ago, we had a group of guys who came in and decided, well, next year's gonna be our year too. Okay, this is gonna be our year. Nobody else thought that was gonna happen. Wasn't one person, except the guys in this room. People standing here looking at each other right now. The only ones who thought that, led by our seniors, led by our guys who are hard ass workers. When you have all the excuses in the world that you can say, hey, this isn't our year, this isn't our year. And they made every excuse in the world to find a way to make it our year. All the work, 364 days of work, of grind, of toughness, of saying, it's gonna be our year, okay? We're gonna have our year. 364 days of saying, I'm gonna do whatever I can to find a way to make this happen, all right? I'm proud as hell of that. But like Coach said, now you gotta finish the job. Now yeah, you gotta go oh. take it. Now let's go, let's go. Let's go. First quarter, Riverdale already up six to nothing, driving again. David Estevez hits Matt Nonahan, but Old Japan forces the fumble. They're able to recover it, and on the ensuing drive, Arquez Antonori takes the cut, and he falls into the end zone. OT leads 7 to 6. Second quarter, Hawks inside the red zone again. Dave Estevez keeps it and runs it up the middle, and he's in there for the end zone. With a 15 yard touchdown. And now 2.40 left in the half. James Kelly takes the handoff and powers through the defense and runs 16 yards for the touchdown. PAT missed. The game's tied at the half. Third quarter, Knights up seven after a punt return. Riverdale trying to respond. Alec Lanza takes the handoff on the end around. Game tied at 20. Riverdale with the ball at midfield, 11 minutes left in the game. Estev is in trouble, he cuts one way, runs back the other, and he finds a wide open Lanza. He takes it downfield. And he gets inside the 20. Now a fourth and one on the eight for the Hawks. Scrambles outside and the pass is knocked down. This one would go to overtime. Riverdale got the ball first and on a three yard line, Lanza takes the handoff in, but the PAT is missed. It's a six point game. Old Japan could win with a touchdown and extra point. Fourth down and two on the 17. The run is stuck. Gerudo wins the state title in overtime, 26 to 20. I mean, Alex, he's always a big playmaker for us. So we knew once he has a ball in his hands, he's gonna make a big play, and that's what he did. I mean, who knew we went to overtime? I mean, both teams are, are just tough teams. And you, got, you know, they're gonna run at you. We don't really pass both teams. It was just a hard power fall game. I mean, yeah, we were all tired. We had four, four courses of hard, tough football. So, and we had to gather all our energy together. And we, and we looked at each other like, oh, we got to get this win. We got to get this win. And we, we made big plays. And then I trusted Alec with the ball. And we, he made a big play. But um, we missed the extra points. So and that was tough. So we, we knew we had to stop him on defense. So I'll stay where we get the extra point. I'm really, really, really happy for this group of guys. I really am. And the coaches, man. I'm really happy for these guys. The whole community. The whole community's been, been uh, just waiting for this. And uh, we graduated, we, you know, we graduated uh, 19 starters last year, and uh, wow. You know, we've been in the semis and the finals every year for the last 10 years, and I think sometimes we don't get the credit for being the kind of program we are because, you know, we don't have the impressive looking kid, but man, they work. You know, and it's a, I'm so proud of the coach. Well, it's awesome, you know. Yeah. Oh man, we haven't won until seven, so we know we have to win this one. We got to run it. One more play. Just yeah, I mean, we worked our whole lives for this, and we finally came out victorious, and it's just great. It's a great feeling.